Unlock the mystery. Understanding. Shut off the valve. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into a phrase that might sound a bit technical but is actually part of everyday language. Shut off the valve. Whether you're at home, dealing with machinery, or simply trying to improve your English, understanding this phrase can be incredibly useful. Let's explore what it means, how it's used, and some examples to make you comfortable with using it yourself. Shut off and the valve are two components that make up our phrase. To shut off, something means to stop it from operating by turning it off or blocking its power source. A valve, on the other hand, is a device that controls the flow of a liquid or gas through a pipe or tube. So, when we combine them, shut off the valve literally means to stop the flow of a liquid or gas by turning a valve to the off position. This phrase is commonly used in contexts where controlling the flow of water, gas, or another substance is necessary. For instance, in emergencies, if there's a leak or a risk of flooding, you might be instructed to shut off the valve to prevent damage or danger. In routine maintenance, plumbers or individuals working on pipes might shut off valves to safely work on the system without the flow. In everyday situations, you might use this phrase at home if you're fixing a sink, working on a water filter, or dealing with appliances connected to water or gas lines. Let's look at a few sentences to see how it's used in context. 1. Before we can replace the pipes, we need to shut off the valve to stop the water flow. 2. The smell of gas was strong, so we had to shut off the valve immediately to avoid any risks. 3. Can you shut off the valve while I clean the filter? These examples show how versatile the phrase can be, applicable in various scenarios requiring control over flow. Understanding phrases like, shut off the valve, can greatly enhance your English vocabulary, especially if you're interested in more technical or specific areas of conversation. We hope this video has shed some light on this useful phrase and that you feel more confident using it in your daily life. Remember, language learning is all about building up from the basics, one phrase at a time. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video.